guys, Toy here, and today I'm shooting a very quick, fun video. I know, I should really be trying to get to my reading challenge, which I am. I'm just way behind on reviews and actually, you know, tracking everything that I'm doing. So I'm going to take a couple of days to try to get that together and hopefully have a video um, for my reading challenge in the next week or two. So, but for now, I thought I would do a fun haul video. This would be like a pre-summer or summer haul. Basically, I got a couple of things that I thought might be worth sharing and so I'm sharing them and it just happens to be getting very close to summer vacation. And if you've watched any of these videos, you know that shopping is not something that I do. I don't know if there was an eclipse or something, but I actually bought some items. I'm going to tell you about it in just a second. First, I want to show you this really cute thing that my husband bought for our dog, Margie. Yeah, even Margie got some stuff, mm-hmm. And of course, I'll show you a picture of her wearing her very cute t-shirt. All right, let's see. Um, so I have, oh yeah, let me start with my books. I always try to show you what kind of books I'm hauling. Most of the stuff that I've been um, getting lately has been like eBooks, but I haven't really been reading much or buying much as far as books concerned. These are actually items I got from the cons that I've went to you know that I talked about and I don't know if I mentioned them so I'm going to show them to you um the faith and fandom book this is finding God and geek culture this is actually the second book but according to the author it doesn't matter what order you read them in just depends on what you're interested in so this one had more items that I was interested in than the first one so I'm starting with this one uh I read so far the forewords that are in the book but again I've been so busy I really will pick it up um, very soon. It looks like a short, fun read. The next thing I got was a comic book. Oh, <laughs> a comic book. And it has the, um, it's called the Arcane Awakening. And since, you know, I love things dealing with angels and demons, I had to check that out. The next thing I want to show you, of course, is the latest vinyl that we've gotten and actually we've gotten quite a few things since my last video but this is the most recent thing that we've gotten and this is Rob Bass and DJ Easy Rock and of course you know we've got It Takes Two and Joy and Pain on that and this was wonderful to add to our collection it's in the turntable right now we've been listening to it and so far no scratches I don't know how that's possible I don't think it's I mean I don't think I've ever bought, uh, you know, <laughs> a hip hop record that didn't have fresh scratches on it unless it was brand new and we didn't get this one brand new. So anyway, that's really cool. And so now I think I'm going to jump into some clothing items. All right. So here's the story. I went to Walgreens to pick up prescriptions. That's the only reason I was there. When I got there, everyone in the city was there picking up prescriptions. I don't know what was happening. Literally, one of the guys who worked there, he was like, we get these rushes sometimes. He's like, if there's anything else you need in the store, you might want to go get it and then come back and see if the line went down. And I was like, you know, that makes sense. I can pick up some lotion and deodorant. I can always use those kind of things. So I went and got those items, started to head back, and something caught my eye. And I was just like, I have to get it. So here it is. I bought some shoes and I don't know if you can see it. They kind of look like a, like kind of like Crocs, but they're not Crocs. I'm going to bring this up. It, it's, it's a brand called Hound Dog. And I had to get them because I have a Hound Dog. And they fit perfectly. I think these are going to be wonderful shoes for um, wearing to the beach, going to the park. These are going to be wonderful summer shoes. And because they were on an amazing sale, I got them in white. And then I also got them in black. I mean, what can I say? They have a little hound dog on the front of them. I had to get them. I don't even like to shop, but I couldn't leave that store without getting these shoes. Yeah. Okay. But it didn't really stop there. At this point, I don't know what happened to me. I think it was still that there was a crowd of people hanging around the pharmacy department. And I just wasn't ready to deal with that crowd because I don't like crowds. So since I was perusing the shoes, I'd already gotten my deodorant and I'd already gotten my lotion. I was like, hmm, what else could I possibly get? So I decided to go check out the accessories because I'm all the time needing stuff for my hair. Those are the only things that I typically buy are accessories. 
but I'm never at a store that sells them, so I'm not really sure how that worked out. Anyway, when I went over to the accessories, I didn't see anything that I liked. They were having an amazing sale on leggings. So yeah, I picked up some leggings. These cool little tan ones have a little designer foot. I think that's great. So do these red ones. And I like these red ones because they're not like a bright, like, in your face red. They're kind of a darker red. And then I actually got some with some cool designs on them. And they were really inexpensive. So I got some leggings. I don't know what came over me. And then last but not least, I was actually out with my husband. And we were, we were trying to find something specific. I don't remember what it was. And I did, um, I got a shirt because it was literally just there on the way out. Didn't require a whole lot of effort. <laughs> and you may or may not be able to see it. But I actually, um, my husband had bought me one similar to it. If you saw my uh, Tidewater Comic Con wrap up, I would think I was wearing a yellow one. And this blue one looks almost just like that yellow one. So when I saw it, I was like, sure, let's throw that in the bag. And so that is my pre-summer-ish haul, the things that I've gathered. And I just feel like sharing them with you. So hopefully I will have something for you as regarding my reading challenge in the next week or two. And until then... Bye for now.